And welcome back to Let's Play Xenoblade Chronicles, episode 26. So we've been contracted to kill some... Kill? Kill some field ponyos. How fitting. Um... And I do believe they're the things that were handing my ass to me uh, a couple episodes back. Are you evil? Well, I mean, are you... None of them are evil. Are you dangerous? Or than usual? You are, though. Hey. Is he shifting? What? Is he chasing after that ponyo? There we go. Oh? I can't believe Ewan asked us for three lots of ponyo neck meat. Oh, okay. Well, I expected there to be more. Mech on M64s. And then we can go back to um, Colony 9 and then go back to the refugee camp and then finally we'll be done for now. And then we can actually start doing saving Juju before he gets eaten. Oh, Death Bangle, that doesn't bode well. It's a huge ether deposit. M64. Everyone, let's go! Don't let a single one escape. Let me at him. Now! Hey, don't look at me. That's right, you guys can't actually do anything. I forgot. That explains why they're all caring specifically about me. Who am I attacking? That's right, no matter what we do, it's always a critical hit. I don't get how they can find the time to actually um, talk to each other in the heat of battle. I sure couldn't. Well, I've never been in a battle, have I? Here's a question. Are we actually able to, um... Uh, what am I? Um, like, do this? Like, if we didn't have any chance? Like, would they be able to damage them? Okay. Let's not lose our heads, though. Let's stay alert. Hmm. Like, ooh, maybe someone from the refugee camp will come. Ah, and then they die. What was the idea behind that noise? You didn't miss, it's just you can't hurt them. Yet. Hey. How dare you? Oh, okay, never mind, I didn't even go off. That was a beautiful. Everyone, let's go! Let's do this! Banking on him having his aggro taunt, and it didn't work out. Get out of here! Shala! I'm on it! Okay, perfect. 
We did it! Man didn't even break we didn't do way. much though. Piece of cake! Let's stay alert. What? Okay, I was gonna say. Hey. Well, there seems to be a little encampment over here, but no. What are they, what are these mech on thinking? Since they uh, probably can think. Oh, a treasure chest. Just like me coming around with their like killing weapon. You know, I think we actually fight M64s in the mine, so yeah. Interesting. I don't remember if doing this stuff. I don't even know where Sky Stage is. Well, maybe I do. Maybe that's where the Eduardo or whatever was. Nope. Well, I'm gonna have to explore this later. So you know what? I think I'm going to just go back to Colony 9, look for people, and then, um... Yeah. And then, yeah. Um, go to back to the refugee camp, and then, um, do stuff the main game we're trying to complete. Hello, sir. I really don't care about your stuff. Ooh, what shady business is going down over here? Alright. Alright. What's with the face? You want to join us? Come on, we're short uh, of members anyhow. You came because you heard about my plan, right? Could you go into more detail? I don't like saying detail because that's how Christ said it in his let's play. Well, you'll never, you'll know soon enough. Better late than never, eh? Here's your first job. Okay. Got two cro croaking brog bags from Sing Brogs in Tefra Cave. Go to Tefra Cave and collect some croaking brog bags for me. You're one of us now, don't let me down. No problem, leave it to me. Nothing can stand in the way when me and Shulk are on the case. You just take it easy and sit tight. Let's give it all we got, Ryan. Okay. Betty's the one to go for? Are we helping a murder? Ah, quests. Who's this? I'm thinking of making some kind of trap for catching insects. I just don't have the time to get all the materials I need. I did this quest in the very first, like, four episodes that you never saw because I was like, now nah, I'm gonna try Wii U. We help a guy out. Plates now. Thanks, I can't wait to start building it. <laughs> Only the resident's quest, the trap was a success, but it didn't catch any bugs. Okay. I mean, you didn't even give him time to try. Did we already do the spanner quest? I have a feeling we already did the spanner quest. You know, this place is looking like it's doing alright. Especially considering the fact... That there was just a huge Mechon invasion like a month back last. I'm used to being in debt, but never this badly. I'll never be able to pay the whole lot back. 
the total keeps growing bigger and bigger and bigger. Worst part is, it's affecting my ability to write anything decent, so I barely have any kind of cash flow coming in at all. Oh? Listen here, Sonny, you better pay me back. 300,000 G in two days. You do realize that what'll happen if you don't pay, right? But, but you can't. We agreed on two months. I can't get it that quickly. Well, the deal's changed. If you don't pay up, I'm gonna seize everything you own. Look, lent me the money is really turning the screws. I don't know what I can do, but I have to keep up payments somehow. Meet King Squee. Okay. In a vision, Leopold is being harassed for money by the loan shark King Squeeze. We need to prevent this unhappy occurrence. Uh, meet King Squeeze and object to his harsh collection methods. What, is King Squeeze right here? What was that red exclamation mark? Yo, Dumban, you okay? Well, he shut himself in his room. That's not a good sign. I imagine there's going to be a quest for killing... Um, I don't know, there was some really powerful enemy on, well, powerful, ooh, level 11, on the, um, one of the anti-air batteries. <laughs> Hello, anyone got some quests for me? I mean, if you don't even have to pay me, just give me the experience of helping you. <gasps> That's all I need. Well, at least the refugee camp is going to be a lot easier to get through since it's so small. Just shame old Square Tash died. I was actually liking him. Ah! Is it the other one? No, it's you. What's up? What's up? Some ridge antos have appeared outside the commercial district. Think you could go and take care of them for me? Sure, help protect the colony by defeating the monsters around anti air battery one. Nice one. You get more of them ridge antles around at night. It's not an easy job, but you should be able to handle it. Sir, we're probably like twice the, si twice the um, ability necessary to do this. A load of cute brogs on a beach near anti-air battery one. <coughs> Can you get rid of them for us? The Vince Force is a bit short-staffed at the moment, considering half her force died. Excellent. Sorry I keep asking for your help. Cute brogs only come out at night, so watch yourself out there, okay? What's up? There's a bunch of colony crabbles attacking people. They live near Cliff Lake. Can I count on you to take a few of them out for me? I mean, why don't you do it? Exterminate them. Thanks a lot. Having you is like having a hundred extra troops. What's up? Even though we're not doing anything. This force isn't exactly a harmonious organization. Captains don't get along. Especially Captain Raul and Captain Emily Leader. Emmy Leader. Oh. I don't like these random just like... <laughs> exclamation marks that are showing up on my mini-map. But finally, we should be able to turn it today. Wait, hold on. Hold on. I think we were seeing King Squeeze harassing that old man who wanted the plate snow. Roll up. Yes. What's up? 
You think I'm pressing our good friend Leopold too much? For money he doesn't have? I can't deny it, but I'm not an unreasonable money lender. I just want to make him to pay back the money he owes me. Is that so much to ask? He could do it if he just stopped splashing out on his girlfriend. Then his wages could go to paying me back instead. Then we'd be square. I'd gladly call the whole thing off. Oh, okay. Once again, very nicely done. Of course. It's child play getting men like him to spend all their money. Oh my god. Good work, my girl. Who are, here's your new orders. This much? Are you nuts? Why do you need him to get into this much debt? I think it's about time I got out of this game for good. Going to that boy's house is a nice area worth quite a bit. Even this King Squeeze is packing it all in, huh? Alright, you got a deal. Expect a sizable contribution to expect a sizable contribution to your retirement fund. Make sure you don't screw this up. And make sure he doesn't find out. You would say that, you're the one who's looking to cash in. He probably would never blame me anyway, he loves me. Wow. What? What do you want? You can wipe that suspicious look off your face for a start. Nothing going on here. How's Sivani or Tulirpod? Oh, we're gonna fucking talk to Le um Sivani. Wow. Hello. Hello. Me and King Squeeze? Uh oh. Have we been rumbled? I suppose I should spill the beans and have the cats out of the bag. He's been squeezing his clients real hard lately. I don't want to work for him anymore. If you want to confront him, though, I know just how to do it. To find his top secret orders I chucked away. I threw them off the central plaza. Hopefully, the orders aren't ruined by now and you can still find them. You can do whatever you like. Leopold's good to me. You, can, you can't stop him looking after me. Wow, originally I was just like, eh, let's do this stuff. Oh, obviously, but the fact now we're in a huge money laundering skit. Is that what it is? I don't know. A debt? A debt ring? A loan shark ring? Just in case. Oh, you, sir. Ugh, it tastes awful. Gorgio. His rate, my career ain't gonna be famous, it's gonna be infamous. That doesn't sound good. I think we, I think we should get the sword as soon as possible. Yeah, we have to do something. In life or death, mate. My curious key ingredients dance apples. They give it the flavor. But oh, my supplies almost run out. Ah, oh, miss, I'm too busy here to go and get any. But you can't stop making it. I'd die if I couldn't eat your curry. Plus, you don't charge extra for a bigger helping. You. You really like me, curry? Oh, thanks, mate. So, you don't mind helping me out? I'll make it worth your while. Your shop, well known for its tasty curries, is running out of ingredients. Help Giorgio by collecting the required ingredients. You really don't mind? <clears throat> it's such a big help. I owe you big time. No problem. Leave it to me. That's right. We can handle it. Oh, we didn't instantly do it. I'm disappointed in myself. Is that the quest I've been waiting all this time for? Because you'll have noticed we got like some guy's like clothing or something or other a while back in like Tefra Cave. No, it's not. I hate these random exclamation marks. I could have sworn I could jump off some of these. Maybe it's just these over here. Yep, they're damaged. 
and I'm willing to bet they got damage in the mech on attack. If there's one good thing that came out of the attack, um, it was getting, it was unlocking that shortcut down here. Top secret orders. Military district. Who's this? My little walks around, let me see just how bad these youngsters are. They haven't got a cat in hell's chance of protecting our colony. Yeah, they didn't. Wow, that's actually sort of sad. If I remember correctly, there are a bunch of people out here, like, doing push-ups and stuff. Now, they're probably all dead, so... Grim. I still want to know what's in these things. It was like... boilers, actually. Well, let me just say that's really highly technical. Well, probably not. It just looks technologically advanced. But then again, isn't like the first computer a huge, like, mile long? It's not a mile, but it's a long, like, dashboard of, like, le um, levers to simulate binary. Yes, the quests. Oh, are they looking at... They're watching this kid. Oh, great. More curry. Well, I've been getting complaints from customers. Sorry to ask, but you could go find me some glowing rocks. Why? You need something to brighten her shop. Find what she needs. Thank you. That should stop me getting any more complaints. I doubt it. Only the residence quest in the shop is much brighter. No, it is not. Oh, we've got some gossip. Me? Yes, you. Hmm. You're in one a friend. Not many no pun in colony, so Nero has no friend to play with. Sounds like you've got a problem. You're not getting us mixed up in someone else's problems again. You're too soft, you are. Still, Shulk's gotta be Shulk. Ryan, I know you want to help just as much as I do. So let's hear what's up. Thank you, thank you. There's a Homs boy called Lucas, Nier and want to be friends with him. Can't you try making friends yourself? No, Nier aren't too scared to. I'm trying to encourage you, kid. Never mind, guess we can help. Nier wrote a letter, but too afraid to give it to him so I, myself. P please, can you give it to me? Give it for him. him. Our boy called Niranya is unable to summon up the courage to deliver his letter to a local homeless boy. Deliver the letter to Nira, to for Niranya to Lucas. Niranya, we're waiting for you. No problem, leave it to me. That's right, we can handle it. And don't read the letter. I swear there was another exclamation mark. Well, that's not the one I was looking for, but... Yes, no. Where's my shiny treasure? I get sad if I don't look at it every day. I'd be really happy if you find it for me. Blue ass bleed. There's lost something important that helps her sleep at night. One of the things she lost. Thank you. I never leave residential district, so it's around here somewhere. Please, you have to find my treasure. Okay, but get ready for the excite. What is special about this? I don't know. But get ready for the exciting conclusion to the King Squeeze, tr like trifecta or whatever. Next time, so 
you enjoyed this video, you know what to do. See ya!